this is how our dotted mouse with csap page looks like that is our uh, csap page which has initialized the community toolkit mouse dot markup this is the plugin that helps us to write the uh, csap implementation for our dotnet mouse uh, the csap page so it helps uh, us to write the properties like center font size text color like this in this uh, pattern so don't forget to add this plugin uh, in our dotnet mouse project so in order to do that go to manage nuket package here uh, let's add dot net maui community just add this type of uh, uh, up to here text then you will just see this plugin add the uh, package to all of your project then add the implementation site just use this tag of line code and don't forget to add this na using namespace that's it so that helps us to write uh, this type of pattern uh, for our uh, control properties so um, that is it so here uh, in this, uh, this the csap implementation we have two type of gradients that is our linear gradient brush as well as the uh, radial gradient brush so you can see uh, we have linear, linear gradient brush and in our previous tutorial also i have already discussed about linear gradient brush where it starts from that is our uh, promlet that is our 0 comma 0 which is uh, added with the concentration of allo color and uh, the floating point uh, is the conversion so here you can see the offset it uh, requires some floating values so i have just converted the decimal to a float values then uh, uh, the same goes for the green color too so here the green color uh, has a uh, concentration offset of 0 0.7 so that is it that initialize this type of gradients in our dot net maui uh, grid so here uh, the content is uh, everything is a grid so here from top to the bottom is a grid and we can add the children uh, of the grid uh, with the label as a control so this is a children of this as a parent so this is a parent so this is the children and we can add a level uh, which can be placed at the center of the uh, grid to populate it at the center of the screen so that is it regarding the linear gradient press then let me just uncomment this code and comment out this code so let's again discuss about this line of code all right so here after restarting the application uh, we got our background radial gradient brush and here uh, we can put the center to 0 comma 0 up over here but its default value is uh, 0 0.5 comma 0 0.5 that is in the middle of the screen so we can put the gradient over here or put it over here or here or here we can just uh, play around uh, with any of the values as we like so as per the requirements then the radius is 10 so we have it in the radius and and then uh, radial gradient stop has three colors so here you can see we have yellow red as well as green that is it so this uh, completes the uh, implementation of radial gradient brush as well as the linear gradient brush for our dotnet maui projects so that is it for this tutorial thank you guys thanks for watching keep in touch for our next tutorials